Today, China's Ministry of Education banned written examinations for six and seven-year-old children as part of education reforms aimed at relieving pressure on students and parents in China's highly competitive school system. China's exam-oriented system previously required students to take exams from first grade onwards, culminating in the feared university entrance examination at the age of 18, known as the Gao Kao, where a single score can determine a child's life trajectory. The regulations also limit examinations in other years of compulsory education to once a term, with midterm and mocks examinations allowed in junior high school. In late July, China ordered all private tutoring firms to turn non-profit and barred tutoring agencies from giving lessons in core subjects at weekends and holidays. Consequently, this move paralyzed the $100 billion sector. The aim is to reduce China's education inequality where some middle-class parents willingly fork out 100,000 yuan or $15,400 or more per year on private tutoring to get their children into top schools. Many also snag property in schools' catchment areas, driving up house prices. Beijing city authorities last week announced that teachers must rotate schools every six years to prevent a concentration of top talent at some schools. Education officials today reiterated a ban on schools setting up priority classes for gifted students. The Ministry of Education also banned written homework for first and second graders earlier this year and limited homework for junior high students to no more than 1.5 hours per night. However, many Chinese parents still regard education as a path to social mobility. The Gao Kao is one of the few ways that poor rural students can access better educational opportunities and job prospects at top universities. Subscribe to One India channel and never miss an update.